I'm actually um, missing therapy to be here, so uh, I really need this to go well. <laughs> I, uh, I love therapy. I think therapy is great. I think everyone should be in therapy. Everyone should be in therapy. Don't do it for yourself. Do it for your friends. <laughs> they don't want to hear that shit anymore. <laughs> if you think you don't need therapy, here's what I want you to do. Uh, tell your best friend that you're thinking about it. Uh, see how relieved they look. <laughs> I, I became an aunt recently. Thank you. Um, my sister did most of the work. Uh, it's cool, you know, I really thought that my parents loved me until they became grandparents. And it turns out they were giving me about 50%. I know what their love looks like now. It's a new thing I hadn't seen before. <laughs> Frankly, it's dazzling. It's cool, he's very cute. We've got a photo stream on our phones for pictures of the baby. Anytime my sister takes a picture of the baby, she adds it to the photo stream. We all get a notification. There's a new picture of the baby. If we hang out with the baby, we can add a picture. That's not what I've been using it for. Uh, what I like to do is I like to upload pictures of myself doing just whatever the baby was doing in the last picture. <laughs> but like, a little bit better. You know what I mean? Like with more dexterity. Like, he's cuter than me. I will give him that. But I put the triangle block right in the triangle hole. First try. None of this banging around on the box. Gotta be worth something. Raising kids seems really hard, which is why I am all in favor of putting your kid on a leash if you want to. It gets a bad rap, but put your kid on a leash. I don't care. I've never seen a kid on a leash who didn't need that leash. <laughs> You know what I mean? The leash is always pulled taut. They're always reaching for a stranger's mouth. <laughs> Put your kid on a leash, I don't care. I don't understand a single argument against it. People are like, I don't wanna put my kid on a leash because I want him to explore. I want him to be an explorer. You guys know explorers, history's worst monsters. <laughs> Why would we encourage that behavior? Maybe. Maybe if Columbus's mom had put him on a leash as a kid, he wouldn't have spent his adulthood genociding everyone. <laughs> Teach boundaries young. People are like, well, what happens when you take the kid off the leash and then they go crazy? And to that I say, I'm not gonna be there then. <laughs> We're all at the airport now. I'm not saying you have to put your kid on a leash. I'm just saying if someone else wants to do it, cut them some slack, which, by the way, is a phrase we got from leashes. <laughs> it, was a, it was a rough election. Uh, I think we all agree on that. I really think Donald Trump was the airbud of this election. <laughs> but I also think that airbud was the villain of that movie. <laughs> I'll explain. Imagine for a moment that you're one of the kids on the other basketball team. Like you're one of the kids who has to play basketball against a golden retriever. <laughs> you're just a kid who loves basketball, right? You've been practicing basketball. You know the rules of basketball. You showed up to the gym that day expecting to play another child at basketball. That's Hillary Clinton, right? I mean, she's just been like, put me in coach for the last 10 years. And we finally did. And then this freaking fluffy dog who has no business on the court comes running out, distracting everybody. He doesn't know the rules. He can't know the rules. He is a dog. He's traveling like crazy. Where's the ref? And everyone's just fine with it because there's nothing in the rule book. 
that says a pumpkin-headed reality TV star can't be president? Let's write more rules. What are we waiting for? Also, I should say, I have not seen Air Bud. But I feel like I pieced it together pretty well, don't you? Uh, thank you guys very much. I think I'm going to have it. Thank you so much. I've seen Air Bud. You nailed it. Oh, Great great job. Fantastic. Hello, everybody. We'll take a break.